Welcome to our virtual law legal analysis series. In today's episode, we will discuss the meaning, application and sample case of a posteriori. Let's dive right into it. In the Philippines, the term a posteriori is used in a variety of contexts, but it generally refers to knowledge that is gained through experience or observation. For example, if you know that the sun will set this evening, that is a posteriori knowledge because you have learned it through experience. Application One application of a posteriori knowledge in the Philippines is in the legal system. When judges make decisions, they often rely on a posteriori knowledge, such as the testimony of witnesses or the results of forensic tests. This is because they cannot know for certain what happened in the past, so they must rely on the best available evidence. Another example of a posteriori knowledge in the Philippines is in the field of medicine. Doctors often make diagnoses based on the symptoms that their patients present. This is a posteriori knowledge because the doctors are using their experience to make inferences about the patient's condition. Sample case Here is a case sample of a posteriori knowledge in the Philippines. A man is accused of murder. The prosecution presents evidence that the man was seen arguing with the victim shortly before the murder. The defense argues that the man was not the killer, and that the evidence against him is circumstantial. The jury must decide whether to convict the man based on the a posteriori knowledge that they have, such as the testimony of witnesses and the results of forensic tests. A woman goes to the doctor for a checkup. The doctor asks her about her symptoms, such as a fever, cough, and sore throat. The doctor then makes a diagnosis of the flu based on the a posteriori knowledge that he has about the woman's symptoms. These are just a few examples of how a posteriori knowledge is used in the Philippines. In general, a posteriori knowledge is any knowledge that is gained through experience or observation. It is a valuable tool for making decisions in a variety of fields, such as law, medicine, and business. That's all for this episode. What do you think about the topic? Feel free to comment and suggest what topic you want us to discuss on the next video. Stay tuned for more legal insights in our future episode. Remember, understanding the law helps us comprehend the intricacies of our legal system. See you next time. Like and subscribe.